welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here welcome this is the art supplies on a budget series and today we are doing pencils no like just normal bog standard pencils um we've got four different types of pencils today uh, and we're going to start off with an asda pen gear pencil uh with the razors these you can get 12 for a pound um they're kind of cool looking to be fair yeah um yeah these are obviously 12 for a pound, making them obviously fairly cheap per unit. Oh, that noise. We'll start off with this one. So just a feel of it, it's quite a light pencil. Um, this is obviously straight out of the pencil, so it's not been a time to be sharpened. So it's quite a blunt one when you pull it straight out. Just come with an eraser though, so you should probably try that out as well. Um, where should we draw? We'll draw in this corner up here. So we'll just draw a simple love heart. Some stars, you know, the normal kind of thing you're going for here. They are very light, but I find them very scratchy pencils, um, which again could just be because it's not a sharp tip, but it is quite scratchy despite kind of being light. Let's try the eraser. The eraser is very good at the end. Race or rubber, whatever you want to call it, um, is very good at the end. It is, yeah, overall it's not an awful pencil. Um, but yeah, I find it quite, quite a scratchy one, to say the least. But yeah, these are the own brand As, uh, yeah, Asda pencils, which is kind of cool. We'll seal that back up so it looks like a new. Perfect. Uh, next, we have some Tesco's. Watch the rivals to Asda. We have some Tesco's mechanical pencils. These are five for a pound. Uh, very colourful pens. A uh, pencil, sorry. Two seconds. Uh, yeah. I've got like a, a thing. Obviously, mechanical pencils and standard pencils are very are slightly different. There we go. I'll start off with this. We'll pull this one out. It's a very colourful pen. Pencil, sorry. Very colourful pencil. It's already come out at the end. Oh, okay. So, again, we'll just do the... See, unlike with that top one, it's not very scratchy. Unless you're doing that. The only thing I dislike about it is the nib. Some of these can break really easily. The lead ain't the best. Let's try the, the eraser at the end, or the rubber, whatever you want to call it. Again, it's a pretty solid rubber, but I guess a rubber is a rubber, you know? It's not an awful pen, you know? Definitely had worse. So I keep calling it a pen, I'm sure I, Yeah, it will be referred to as a pen, but it's definitely a pencil. I do love these. They are my preference when I draw sometimes, if I ever use a pencil. Um, but I'd say these are probably slightly better than the Asda as the pencil. Let's pop that back in there so we don't lose them. So yeah. Next we have the Papermate mechanical pencils. <laughs> These I have a lot of, um, but we have them in the packaging here as well. So for four of these, usually they're about £1.61 on Amazon. I'm sure you can get them cheaper elsewhere. Obviously, this is a pack of 10, um, which I'm not going to open because we have because we have these, um, uh, which I may have found after I bought them. Um, I'll use this one, you know. So, obviously, we've seen the paper mate. Um, oh, it's not one of those. Oh. That's not a clicky instantly, which is a bit strange. This is where there's, like, no lead in it, and I'm looking like a tit. Uh, oh, yeah. So, you... There we go. We swivel the end. Oh no. No, I don't like this one as much. It's a nicer lead, but I mean you can buy lead on its own. No. No, no it just doesn't feel, it's a lot darker. The rubber is not, or the rubber or eraser, whatever you want to call it, is not as good either. It's a HB. It's from the USA. Uh, there we go. But no, um, it's a pencil. If, you, if this is all you have as an option, 
by all means they're great um but i personally prefer the, the tesco's ones unfortunately unfortunately depending on your outlook in life let's put these down here and last but by no means least we have the bic evolution these ones for 15 you can get for two pounds 69 on amazon and it comes with a little rubber um save me opening it i have one i already had from another pack which seems to be the case with all of them to be fair this again is a hb pencil um which is always good and the eco um the eco friendly oh it's a very very soft pencil which i like in a pencil it's not scratchy at all you know you can't test the the eraser because uh, it's in the package but yeah that's a really nice nice pencil they are the most expensive um but i but per unit they're not the most expensive if that makes sense per unit the paper mate mechanicals are more expensive these again a fantastic pencil um so yeah if these if you have these locally the big ecolutions or evolutions ecolution evolution there we go um these are amazing pencils again for 15 for 2.69 it's not bad they're under a pound each they're even under 50 p each which to be fair is amazing um really good you know shock resistant so if you kind of hit them or whatever accidentally drop them that lead inside doesn't break as easily which is amazing they're 70 57 percent recycled which is even better if you're if you like having eco-friendly materials so yeah i would highly recommend these um, they're not too expensive they are a good brand obviously bic is a trusted brand um but yeah they're fantastic um can't fault them um I would highly recommend the Tesco's mechanical pencils. I preferred them to the paper mates. The paper mates I was very disappointed in, so I'm not going to recommend them. I would say the Tesco's mechanical pencils up there for sure. And I would say the Asda pencils again. If you just want a simple pencil without having to go for Bic, they are cheaper. Obviously, you do get 12 for a pound. That's preference for 15 for £2.69. But yeah, they are also a solid pencil. So the recommendations I've got for this are the Asda uh, pen gear pencils with erasers. 12 for a pound the tesco mechanical pencils five for a pound or the bic eco evolution which are 15 for two pounds 69 on amazon i'm sure other retailers do stock them so yeah thank you for watching i will be back next week possibly with colored pencils um or crayons we'll kind of see what what happens in the next week but in the meantime stay safe wear a mask and all that jazz and i'll see you all real soon thank you guys